Hi everyone, hope you're having a good day today. Now we are having our third lesson in our semester, which is named Fulham Trend. Fulham Trend, as we previously studied, means full M style. Mean like I am trendy, I am latest to the mode. So we previously studied the vocabulary part, now we're studying the grammar part. It's simple and easy, and we have previously studied these uh, the first semester, so it's about a revision or a quick revision. We are gonna have it together now. In this lesson, we're gonna study the personal pronoun. Personal pronomen im accusative. The accusative case we previously studied it before, but we are gonna have a quick revision about it now. So please focus with me. Try to memorize what I everything I said and focus. What is accusative? What does it mean? Accusative is a case. The accusative case's main function is to show the direct object of a verb. So, the accusative is a direct object. We have two kinds of object in the sentence, direct and indirect. So, the accusative means the direct object of the verb. And we can find the direct object by finding the verb and asking what or whom. So, we have a sentence and we're going to ask about the verb or the object with what or whom. So, easy in Arabic. Again. Accusative the أصلا هو الفاعل المباشر أو المفعول المباشر هو بيجيب لنا فعل الفعل ده بيعمل حالة معينة اسمها الأكوزاتيف والأكوزاتيف ده بيغير تغيرات معينة في الجملة فبالتالي بيكون المفعول بتاعه مفعول مباشر Here accusative Here in this sentence there is a man who found a ball so we here describe the whole case of this man and also the action and the way we are going we are doing this only by using accusative the sentence is their man fended them well their man is a nominative because the um, article is there but ball has the article then and the article then is in the accusative form. Again, في الجملة دي عندنا بنوصف فيها حالة الأكوزاتيف. عندي هنا subject وعندي هنا object. The subject اللي هو the man اللي هو الرجل. وده الأداة بتاعته في حالة النومناتيف اللي هي the. لكن في حالة الأكوزاتيف اللي هو عن the object اللي هو the ball اللي هي الكرة. The ball الأداة بتاعتها then مع إن أصلاً إن the ball أداتها there. لكن عشان في حالة الأكوزاتيف حصل لها تغيرات معينة وبقت اسمها دن. So there are some changes that happens to the articles and specifically بشتمتا and بشتمتا article in the accusative case. But we we are having only the changes of the بشتمتا article, so we are having a quick revision on the بشتمتا article in a nominative. And after this, we're going to study the changes that happens in accusative detail. Again, في حالة الأكوزاتيف بيحصل فيه تغيرات معينة بتحصل في الأداة. طبعاً إحنا عندنا نوعين من الأدوات، أدوات النكرة وأدوات المعرفة. حالياً في السمستر ده إحنا عندنا أدوات المعرفة اللي هي الألف واللام اللي هي الداء دي دس وندي. هنذاكر بالضبط الحاجات اللي هي التغيرات اللي بتحصل على الأدوات دي. In details, بعد كده هنكمل مع بعض. First, بشتمتا article in nominative. هناخد دلوقتي الأدوات في حالة النومناتيف اللي هي أدوات المعرفة. الكازوس اللي هي الحالة الكيس. ماسكولين اللي هو ماسكولين مذكر. بعد كده فيمينين اللي هو المؤنث. بعد كده نوتغال اللي هو المحايد اللي هو ليس بمذكر أو بمؤنث. بلورال اللي هو البلورال اللي هو الجمع. عندي كل كيس من دول في أداة. ماسكولين takes there but feminine takes the neutral takes does plural takes the so 
We have two similar articles, D on D, but in a different word. So we're going to focus on the word itself to pick the specific and suitable, suitable article. Examples of the accusative. Now we're gonna study the changes that happens in the article to the articles in the accusative case. So the articles are there, thus the on the. There is nominative, but it turns to then in accusative. So there takes then. Thus become thus still D for feminine form takes D, but D in the plural also stays D. So the only change happens to the masculine. There becomes then easy. The articles in nominative, the adawat for halit in nominative are there with you to thus. مع الاسم المحايد دي مع الحالة المؤنسة دي also مع الحالة الجامعة لكن ما بيحصلش تغيرات أبدا أبدا غير للدايع بس اللي هي في حالة المذكر بتبقى then so the changes in the accusative to the articles بشتمتع article there becomes then thus stays thus دي feminine stays دي D plural also stays D. So now we're gonna have some examples on accusative and we're gonna pick it together. V fend is to do then hoot. As we remember, hoot, the article in nominative for hoot is there. So in this sentence, the articles are in accusative excellent so their hood turns to then hood in this question the fence to then hood how do you find the hut how do you find it we are talking about the hut the, the second sentence then hood find the issue then hoot. Das Mädchen sucht die Hose. Das Mädchen is looking for the pants. Die Hose is a plural word, but it takes the article D, so it stays also in the accusative form as D. The next has to den globus. Has to then globus. The article in accusative is then, and the main article in nominative is there. So globus in nominative is there globus, but in accusative is then globus. So the article there turns to then in article. Has to defida mappe. Fida mappe is a feminine word, and the article of fida mappe is D. For sure, it stays in the same form in accusative because there tends to then, thus tends to thus. D stays D, and D in the plural form also stays D. Thank you guys. Hope you remember and study everything I said. Thank you.